Welcome to the Recipe Rebellion. I'm your culinary rebel priestess, Rachel Lavoni, and I kick cookbooks to the curb and make you an everyday confident on the fly cook. Welcome to the holiday episodes. This is part two of our holiday shows. Now in the first one, I introduced you guys to the official Recipe Rebellion mascot, Rottweiler, Gaia, and I shared with you some of her favorite home cooked meals and snacks. But this episode, is all about what we as humans can eat for the holidays, specifically dessert. You girls like dessert? Yeah. Yay! And to help me with the task, I've invited dessert and holiday enthusiasts to the show. Hi! Hi. This is Margo. Hi, Hi Margo. Hi. This is Lulu. Hi. Hi, Lulu. And mm -hmm. you guys love dessert, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And you love the holidays, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, guess what, girls? Today, we are going to be making an apple crisp that infuses the entire house with the smell of cinnamon and apples. Does that sound good? Yeah. Yeah? And then the rebellious part is, is that we won't tell them, but there's no refined sugars. It's totally gluten-free. There's only five ingredients, and it takes five minutes to make. Shall we get started, girls? Yeah. Awesome. Okay, what do you think that we need first for this? Apples. Yay, apples! <laughs> Do both of you like apples? Yeah. yeah. Yes? Okay, so what we're gonna need, because what we're, we're building is layers of apple. Of apple. <laughs> and so what we're gonna need is to take a couple apples and we're gonna need to slice them this way um, so they're round chips, mm -hmm. right? Do they have to be round chips? No. No! We can, why? Because we can do whatever we want in the Recipe Rebellion kitchen, right? Yeah. <laughs> do you guys, do you girls always follow the rules, by the way? Yeah. Sometimes. Yeah. Sometimes. Sometimes not. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so, Lulu, do you think that you are up for the task of cutting some uh -huh. of these apples? And you have excellent safety knife skills, <laughs> right? Mm -hmm. I've seen you cut at, at home, apples at home, all by yourself. Right, so I know that you are very safe with a knife, right? And never put your uh, safety trick as you want to put make a claw on the apple, right? And then you'll never want to uh, put your fingers in the way. There we go. Good job, Margo. Um, I'm going to. All, would you like to cut apples, or do you just want to help Lulu? Um, I'll help them. Okay, you help Lulu. I'm going to also cut some. I'm gonna bring out the very, very sharp knife here. And the reason that I like uh, to cut them in little um, thin slices like this is because of this, girls. Look at this. Ooh, aw, isn't it cute? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Look, they could be for eyes, too. <laughs> now, we uh, cook at your house all the time, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. What kind of things do you guys like to make? Apple pie. Oh. Brownies. Very and nice. Cookies. I want to make cakes sometimes. Oh, cakes. And um, how do you guys know how to make the cakes? Oh, uh, mom helps us. Yes. Your mom's a very excellent cook and baker. You guys are very lucky. Yes. And if you want to win points right now, you look in the camera and you just say, I have the best mom in the whole wide world. You want to say that? <laughs> no. <laughs> you can tell her at home. How about that? Yeah? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, Lulu, excellent job on these apples. They are amazing. So, Margo, would you build a layer of apples at the bottom of that dish for mm -hmm. me? Okay. And what do you guys love about, the holidays are coming up, right? And what do you guys, what do you girls love about the holidays? Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving, what do you like about Thanksgiving? Um, we get to order a chocolate turkey. Oh, that's awesome. It's a big chocolate turkey. Yeah, and what do you mm -hmm. do with this big chocolate turkey? We eat it eat each it. day. You what? We eat, eat it each day. Oh, you mean one day? You eat a little bit of it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then that's the same, and that's the same, and that's the same. And then how do you know um, what part of the turkey to eat? We like, just, do you eat the head first? Do you eat the butt first? What we just eat? eat any part. <laughs> we just eat the any head. part first. You, you eat the head first? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah? Margo, that is excellent job. 
Okay, next up for our apple crisp, which is um, we're, sh we're seeing here, there's only five ingredients. So apples, we're gonna use caramel sauce. It has to be mm. my caramel sauce that I make though, okay? Mm -hmm. um, oatmeal, we're gonna use coconut milk and we're gonna use walnuts, okay? Um, so, what I need is, um, Margo, would you like to spread the caramel sauce? Mm -hmm. um, so now that we have a layer of apples, we're gonna spread, if you wanna spread the caramel sauce, we'll bring it closer to you. And how old are each of you, by the way? I'm eight and I'm six. Wow. Do you like being eight and six? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's a good age to be? Mm -hmm. Yeah? <laughs> um, so Margo, if you could, um, Go ahead and just smooth as best as you can. It doesn't have to be perfect, because remember in the recipe Rebellion Kitchen, in Ray Ray's Kitchen, you never have to do anything perfectly. Yeah. All right? Mm -hmm. And guess what happens when you make mistakes? What? You can fix it. We love them, right? Because mm -hmm. that means that you'll get a different, something new will come out of it, right? Okay, now, if you would like to know how to make my totally sugar-free uh, caramel sauce, um, you'll want to check back on my previous episode that I did um, because I did a, a whole cooking show just on how to make this caramel sauce. I put um, I put a little bit of syrup in it. You guys like syrup? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Now, I know that you guys like sweet things, so I know it has to be super sweet. So, Margo, you take the caramel sauce and you want to smear that over there. And Lulu, I have a very special job for you. Are you mm -hmm. ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, we're gonna be putting walnuts in the apple crisp, and your job is to grind the walnuts. And you know how we do that? How? We get to beat it. Do you like to beat things? Yes. <laughs> yes? Not very hard. So all I need you to do is to pound those walnuts and break them up. Yes, as best as you can. Good job, Margo. You're doing a great job. So while you guys are doing that, um, I brought a couple pictures on the show, Margo, of while we've been out with our adventures together. Um, and I thought that maybe you could help me explain some of these pictures. Would you please look at the, the screen right up there and help me explain this picture? It looks like you're a professional chef. Um, sort of. Yeah? Yeah. You like cooking? Uh-huh. Very nice. Okay, now, there's another picture that I was hoping you could help explain. Oh. Is this you waking up in the morning? Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? Do you remember that day? Yeah, we were at a Halloween store, and I found a mask that looked like that. Oh, and what about <laughs> this one? I'm a poodle in that picture. <laughs> I thought, you know, I was really debating, because you know, I, I introduced um, Gaia, which you, who you guys know and love, right? Mm -hmm. As the uh, official Recipe Rebellion mascot. But I was thinking that actually after seeing that picture, that you could be with the dog mask on. That'd be fun? Mm. <laughs> Good job. All right, now that we have a layer of caramel sauce, and how you doing on the walnuts, Lulu? Good. Yeah? You getting out some uh, some feelings on those walnuts? <laughs> yeah? <laughs> okay, now, Lulu, will you take will you take uh, some walnuts and just sprinkle a layer mm -hmm. on there? Good job. Can you help me open this? Sure. Of course. There you go. And just sprinkle. Sprinkle some walnuts. I'm gonna keep chopping some apples. And guess what? I know you guys like it extra sweet, so guess what we're gonna do? We're gonna add a little extra syrup on this one. Oh, sorry, Lulu. <laughs> you wanna lick it off or do you wanna wipe it off? Oh, yeah. Here, you can use this. There you go. Okay, and the next ingredient we have is oatmeal. Do you guys like oatmeal? Mm hmm Yeah? Mm-hmm. Okay, we're gonna add a layer of oatmeal. Okay? 
Another layer of apples, please. And then Lulu, you can go ahead and start. Um, here, I'll give you some apples to also here to layer on there. Okay. Good job, girls. This is beautiful. More caramel sauce, please. Okay. And then I'm also going to add some extra cinnamon. We're going to add some extra cinnamon and all that. Ooh, is this looking delicious? Yes. Yes? It's so yeah. good that I want to eat it right now. Okay, well then, the last ingredient, if you even want it sweeter, you can add honey yes. with the maple syrup. Mm -hmm. The last ingredient we're going to do after you fill this to the top, right, is we're going to use some coconut milk and we're going to drizzle it so the oatmeal has something to soak up, right? So when, at the end, you would just drizzle this on top. And then this goes, guess what girls, this goes into the oven for about, you know, maybe half an hour to 45 minutes, mm -hmm. right? Like 375 degree oven. Mm -hmm. And then what's gonna happen is the oatmeal is going to soak up the coconut milk with the caramel sauce, and it's gonna smell like the holidays in the house. Do you guys wanna see what it looks like? Yeah. Okay, let's reveal. Lulu, you do the honors. Ready, set, show everybody what it looks like when it's done. And then I think we should even try it. What do you girls think? Yeah? yeah? Mm -hmm. So let's cut it. And let's look at all the the layers that we have in here. Oh it's kind of messy, <laughs> huh? But that's okay, because we don't mind messy, right? Nope. Nope. Okay. And guess what? If you need to, you can always add more syrup. There's yours, Lulu. You can add more honey. Can you could, okay, you can add ice cream, I guess. <laughs> all right. All right, Margo, and then we need some, you guys just want to nibble with your hands. I think I have some forks down here somewhere, but here we go. There you go. And then I'm gonna try it too. Do, you, do either of you need more syrup? More syrup. You need more syrup? Mm -hmm. More sugar, please. <laughs> there you go. Ooh, and now guess what? You guys can eat this for dessert, and then you can wake up in the morning and have it for breakfast. Mm. Isn't that the best? Mm -hmm. Let me grab a fork. Mmm. It's still warm from when mm -hmm. I made it this morning. Mmm. This is so amazing. The layers of the apple with the oatmeal with the apple. and the caramel sauce. It's super yummy, huh? Mm -hmm. Girls, do you think that you'll make this at home? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm Yeah? All right. Thank you so much for joining us today on the Recipe Rebellion. Mm -hmm. Don't mm -hmm. forget to catch all of our episodes on YouTube and like and subscribe them if you too enjoy the ways of rebellion. I'm your culinary rebel priestess, Rachel Lavoni, and this is... Margo. And this is... Lulu. And we want to thank you and wish you for the courage to unleash your confident cook on the fly side. Let's all together now. See you next time. See, See you next, next time. time.